What is going on, Chaotix? It is your boy ChaosMay006 here, back with the final episode of the Pokemon Platinum Elite Lock. We are here at the Elite Four, rocking with the full team at level 30, level 35, level 53 for everyone. Final move sets here for Mag Mortar. We have Flamethrower, Thunderbolt, Rock Climb, and Psychic Move. The moves that we've been dealing with for the last part of the game. So that is what we're going to be dealing with for the end of this series. Um, I need to switch the mind plate. I didn't switch the items, um, so that's part of the reason why I, I needed to do a team recap. Just to make sure I have the correct items on the right Pokemon. Uh, I don't think I have any fire boosting moves. It would be nice to have a fire boosting thing. I don't think I do. Psychic type, ghost, electric. bug so I guess for week two I guess thunder electric would be a better one so let's give it a magnet so we, so we have Flint holding the magnet magnet we got through all that stuff Lucian is here holding the fist plate with psycho cut return and drain punch and sword stance as its final move set for gum we're dealing with the same final move set surf flash cannon ice beam and waterfall I want to give you a different item because I do not need an amulet coin right now. Uh, don't need dark. I can sell some stuff, but I, I think I'm fine with what I have right now. My place not gonna help you. Do you have like an ice, an ice thing or a water thing to help you? Psychic. Yeah, no. Sadly, no. Can I buy anything from you guys that would help me right now? Why would I want to buy Pokeballs? That's just dumb. Alright, let's talk to this person. Oh. Alright, so I don't have anything to give the book of gum, so that's fine. Bertha is rocking with uh, Earthquake, Crunch, Stone Edge, and Strength. I can give you a different item, which I do want to give you. But Garchomp has that item, and Garchomp is level 55, because I said I would get it that way so it could learn Dragon Rush. It's going to be holding a Dragon Claw, so it gets uh, boosted Dragon-type moves. But Earthquake, Dragon Rush, Shadow Claw, and Cut. And finally, we have Aaron, our Drapion with Poison Jab, Crunch, x Scissor, and Aerial Ace. I want to see, do I have a po I think I have a Poison Barb, so that would help. The Poison Barb would be really great. I'm pretty sure I have a poison barb. I got a razor claw. Boost critical hit ratio. I'm gonna give you a razor claw. Actually, I wanna give you the black. I need you to have black glasses. So, let's do that again. Give you the black glasses. We'll give you the dragon fang. Or dragon claw, dragon fang. To boost that. I will give Napoleon the razor claw. To boost critical hit ratio. And I will give Bertha the soft sand. Alright, so that's the team going into this tournament, this challenge. Um, at the end of the last episode, I did buy a bunch of medicine, so I have 52 hyper potions, I have 8 revives, a couple awakenings, and max revives as well. Ice heals, burn heals, max potions. I have 117 full restores, so I think we're absolutely ready. Got a few elixirs and things. Ready to go, but we're gonna take on the gym challenge now. The Elite Four now. Let me confirm you, I qualify to challenge the Pokemon League. So let's examine this gym badge you get to you know. The gym badges. Yeah, we're... Screw you. Yay, we did it. We can go battle. Five minutes of Team Recap. Wow. I wanted to be sure I was ready, y'all. So I will be doing speed up for, uh, just to get to the gym. Ooh, this is a cool look. Alright, let's go. First, Elite Four member. That's what we're dealing with right now. Hello, welcome to the Pokemon League. I'm Aaron of the Elite Four. It's good to meet you. I should explain, I'm a huge fan of bug Pokemon. Bug Pokemon are nasty and mean, yet so beautiful. Would you like to know why I take on challengers here? Because I want to become perfect, just like my bug Pokemon. Okay, let me take you on. Alright. 
first battle of the Elite Four. Let's go versus Aaron. What do you got, Ayan Mega? Oh, this thing could set up in my face. We are going to be over leveled for Aaron and um, Bertha. But once we get past those two, which well, should be about the same. That's Ayan Mega down. Okay, that's one down. Vespa Quinn. Stay in. I have no reason to switch here. Pressure is going to be a pain in the butt. Alright, that's Vespa Quinn down. That's his, not his ace. His ace is Drapion. Duh. So Flint's going to be really useful at this fight. Uh, Heracross. Yeah, we're fine. If I was set up with uh, Lucian, that would be great to have too. We should be faster. Yeah, Magmortar might not look it, but it's pretty fast. Highly recommend you use one on your team. Especially if you want to try this challenge out for yourself. We're just going to have to trade in a Magby from another version and start it that way. Scizor, you're four times weak to fire. I'm using all my fire moves now because it's not going to be really useful for anything else in this, in this uh, challenge. So I'm perfectly fine with letting Flint just go ham through uh, Lucian. Because there's no other way. There's really no other... Who else are we going to use fire type moves on? Bertha's team doesn't really want them. So Dark and... Oh, uh, this, I should have switched here. Dark and Poison type. So this is not a fire type. I mean, not a... There's a cross poison that you see. Okay, so this is not what I want to deal with. Lives. Citrus buried. So, um, let's see if it goes cross poison again. I think Gun's answer here. Perfect. Alright, um, I need to conserve moves. What is Surf going to be good against? The ground types, so I don't really want to use that. Let's use Flash Cannon. He's still alive. Okay. So this gives me a chance to switch into Lucian, because full restore is coming. Bada bing, bada boom. Okay, let's Swords Dance. And Drain Punch. We're fine, we're fine, we're fine. We're fine. Swords Dance, Drain Punch should be enough poison. I don't think I actually resist fighting, so I think we're okay. Even that, we're plus two. Oh my gosh, it's so bulky. Okay, Aerial Ace is your best bet. It's not going to do that much to me, but I still want to heal. Just to be safe. Just in case you... Yeah. So you're putting us back down to where we were. Drain Punch again. We're close. That's going to be the end of Drapion. So, yeah. We, we're on par with his Ace, which is going to be kind of scary for the rest of this challenge. Because... That's just going to be a weird challenge. Aaron's done. That's one of one of our four Elite Four members down. So we got four more to go because we have to fight Cynthia too. All right. Three trainers wait for you. All tougher than him. All right. Let's hyper potion up. Flint needs fully healed. Lucy needs fully healed. Gum needs a little bit. Alright, ground is our next component. So Flint is going to be absolutely useless here. But Gum is going to be pretty decent. One of our better ways to deal with uh, the ground typing. Bertha actually is pretty tricky. Because, um... Bertha is really tricky because uh, ground actually is pretty decent against Napoleon. So that's not... My fa the most favorable matchup, but let's go ahead and I want to lead with Apollyon anyway. Well, well, you're quite the adorable trainer, but you've got your spine on burst. I prefer and I have a preference of ground type Pokemon, which you showed you so lady how much you've learned. Obviously, I, I didn't learn to bring a steel type against a ground type Pokemon because, uh, yeah, we're gonna get our butts kicked if we're slower than that. So, Wish Cash already making me kind of wish I um, had the grass move still. It's not even half. Earth power. Okay, we're fine.
She's just gonna be. This is gonna be a problem. Let's go, Cynthia. We can take an Earth Power. Uh, let's, uh, I need to Dragon Rush for Cynthia, but let's go ahead and use one. I missed. I need to heal. Cause I can't. I can't afford Cynthia losing a life here, cause it's the only life. So Sandstorm is up now. That's gonna be a pain in my butt. Dragon Rush K connects and knocks out. Okay, Gliscor. We switch back into uh, Gum here. We'll take a turn to heal. That is the smart and correct play. Maybe it wasn't! Do we outspeed? You're, you're on your last life. I need you for... Garchomp's gonna just do the same thing to you. Or do I lose you right now? It's a Gliscor. Okay. Alright, so, um... I'm pulling out the old... I'm pulling out the old, uh, Dex. We're gonna compare base stat totals. <laughs> Comparing speed. Uh, let's let's do compare Pokemon. I need to compare uh, Napoleon versus. Oh, we're not gonna outspeed a Gliscor. Napoleon versus Gliscor. It's not even close. It's 95 to 60. So we're gonna get our butts kicked if we try to stay in. So I can't stay in and take an earthquake. So somebody's got to come in or take an earthquake here. I think birth action makes sense. Thunderfang, good call. Good, good predict switch. Uh, let's go Stone Edge. Stone Edge was for the ground type, was for um, the bug Pokemon. If I need it, if need be, Stone Edge is gonna be nice here though. Hopefully. Oh, it does nothing. Let's try Crunch. No defense drop, which kind of sucks. Okay, Bertha, you're gonna have to whittle down. I do have ethers and potions like that, so I'm not worried. So I'm gonna. This is the one battle I will speed up. The one matchup I will speed up because I do need that defense drop. You probably heal up here, which is okay. Not my favorite thing in the world. See if we can get another defense drop. Our crit's fine. Let's Stone Edge. That kills. Alright, that's Gliscor down. Hyperior. Four times weak to water. Well, I think Cynthia comes in here. Good switch in here. 55, 55 Earthquake is gonna do a nice chunk of damage. Hopefully. That's a good bit of damage. Avalanche! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. No! No! I lost. I just lost. I just lost. That's game over. What do I... I just lost. Cause that was Garchomp was the way to deal with her Garchomp. Crap. Do I Swords Dance or do I just Drain Punch? I think I'm in range for Drain Punch, so let's just Drain Punch. I'm not in range for Drain Punch. Okay, she heals. I need to. No, she doesn't heal. Okay, I just need to Drain Punch then. Okay, what up? You got a hip out on. Earthquake's gonna do what we want. Okay, Bertha, you're up. This is technically not her highest level Pokemon, but it's her ace. Oh, you turd. Earthquake's coming in. No one wants to take an Earthquake. I'm just gonna have to stay in. Let's crunch. 
Full restore is the play. Sheesh. Got a crit too. Sheesh. That's just... Today's not my day. I lost Garchomp and I need Garchomp. Like, Garchomp is my way. I need to stop crunching. I need a defense drop. Thank you. Okay, full restore. We hit. We get hit by earthquake. That's fine. Stop using crunch. Come on, chaos. Earthquake. I gotta use strength there. What else do you have? A golem. All right, we can take a golem. Let the potion up. We're fine. Don't explode. It's on one, it's sturdy. Okay, I don't lose anything by hitting strength here. Okay, that's Bertha down. And at the cost of our guard chomp! Oh, come on, that was our best member of the team. Garchomp would be the first one to lose all its points. Okay. We gotta regroup. We gotta regroup and focus here. Alright, next is Flint. Again, I'm gonna leave with gum. Since it would be really nice to have right now. Let's go ahead in here. Cynthia's just gone because that's. I wanna. I'm gonna make sure, real quick. Cynthia, yeah, no lives. Yeah, that's that, that's that's over. Cynthia's gone. Okay, Flint is our next. Yo, trainer, you had me counting my days to fingers waiting on you to come. I heard from Vulcan what you did in Sunny Shore. You managed to light a fire in that guy's heart again. How could you not expect me to look forward to our battle? You're facing a fire type Pokemon trainer like me. Let's Flint show you how hot the spirit burns. Oh, God. You better have burn heal. I do. I actually do have like 10. So, Houndoom is your lead, okay? Surf it. Flamethrower. Don't do a lot. Please don't. Okay, it does 60. That should kill. Maybe Aqua Jet. Maybe I should have gone the move to leader and relearn Aqua Jet. Infernape. I don't really want to fight that. Lucian is our bet here. Psycho cut it. Flare Blitz. Come on, you can take it. You have defensive investment. You can take it. Just fire back Psycho Cut. Take him out. See, if we did Diamond and Pearl, actually, Infernape would be one of the members of our team. Instead of Magmortar. So I'm kind of glad that I did this version instead. Rapidash. Alright, it's got Bounce. Um, what does it try to do to me? Let's go, Gum. Probably should heal, but uh, I'm gonna. I need to heal. I need to keep Gum alive. Let's serve. Don't burn, 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 don't burn. Thank you! Thank you! Oh, we live. Magmortar. I need chip damage on this thing, so Bertha, you're gonna have to come in and do this. Oh my gosh. We've got Solar Beam. Come on. Come on. Yes! Oh, okay. That's what we needed, Bertha. That's that's the break we needed. New it new solar beam. <laughs> Flareon's the last mom, we're fine. We'll stay in. Earthquake. Overheat, don't kill, don't kill, don't kill. We oh my gosh, that's powerful. That's Flareon down, so Flint is gone. I sped that up. I'm sorry guys. Oh, Sheesh. 
9 HP is too close. Alright, so finally it's Lucian. And uh, I don't think it should be a surprise that I should leave with Aaron. But I do have Flynn to come in on fire type moves and things like that. And then we're facing Cynthia. Oh, I still have a red ball active. Wow. Alright, let's do this. Ah, you timed your life or well. I just finished reading the book, you see. Allow me to introduce myself. I'm Lucy, one of the users of Psychic Titan. I must say, you've already proven yourself to be outstanding by coming this far. They say I'm the toughest of the Elite Four. I'm afraid I'll have to go all out on you against you to live up to that reputation. Please don't go all out on me, Lucy. I just want to say the level jump in this Elite Four is crap. Because it starts at level 50 and it's like, oh yeah, Cynthia is, is like level 62. Cool, have fun. So, Psychic type. Pure Psychic. Fun fact, I don't know which is actually better to use. Crunch is better to use, what am I talking about? Crunch is the better one to use. Yeah, which is better to use uh, on the Psychic type? Uh, one that's stab and also good against Psychic, or one that's good against Psychic? Uh, I guess the one that's stab and good against Psychic. Ron Zong. Alright, this is where Flint comes in handy. Don't be heatproof, be levitate. Be levitate Bronzong. Be levitate Bronzong. Be levitate Bronzong. Don't be heatproof, be levitate Bronzong. Be levitate Bronzong. There was levitate Bronzong in the back. Yay, we did it. Okay. Hey, this episode might go a little over too, because we're almost at 30. Gallade. A Gallade versus Gallade fight would be fun. But I don't want to take that risk. Also, got everyone's weak against it. It's Glade versus Glade, my friend. Okay, it's not Glade versus Glade. He's level 59. Let's predict the Psychic. Oh. Predict fighting, but we gotta get Vertu in here. Ooh. Okay. So I know Glade does get Glade gets justified, right? Glade gets I I should know this. I have a stead flask, Glade, so if I get flinched, I boost speed. But I'm pretty sure Glade gets justified. Which, justified, if it's hit by a dark type, it raises the attack stat at one stage. But I don't know if I, I don't do I take that risk? Do I take that risk? Do I take the risk that Glade has, um... Do I take the risk that Glade has Steadfast? Or do I... Does Glade have Steadfast or does it have, um, Justified? Do I hope it has Steadfast and hit Crunch? Because Crunch would be more effective here. Honestly, and I do know that uh, probably be a better move to go for. Does it have crunched or does it have stead? I mean, does it have steadfast or does it have uh, or justified? I think I th I'm pretty sure it's a steadfast. Loose, it's steadfast. Because I think I made mine with the same ability, so I'm pretty sure it's a steadfast. So I think I'm fine with crunch. Do not crunch. Leaf. It's got leaf blade. Why did? I know it has leaf blade. Dummy. Okay, we're fine. Crunch it. Lowers defense. Okay. It's a steadfast. Perfect.
can't, yes, it's back in. Okay, good. Okay, <laughs> figured that. Oh, I just clicked off of both the things. Let me get that back up. All right, not up. Yes, bag item use. Deal burst up. That's gonna be the play. Citrus berry. I think I heal stall until it gets to its break. Yeah, I just gotta heal stall. Heal stall until it gets to the break. I have enough potions and things like that to deal it. So I heal stall until it stops leaf blading me or it starts um so it stops leaf blading me or it go or he gets low enough that he's gonna go for a potion. Birth is actually on K to sack. Okay, he's he's gonna heal next turn. Crit. Of course it's a crit. One thirteen. I had that's speed invested, so he's probably about one thirteen. Cynthia could easily outspeed. I think Aaron's the play here. We outspeed. We have to outspeed. X is it. We outspeed. Defense drop, that's fine. <laughs> okay, birth of going down was okay. We outspeed. That's that's We got one more. What else she got? An Alakazam. Alright, we're fine. Don't be focused blast Alakazam. Do not be focused blast Alakazam. <laughs> I don't want to look at this. Don't die, don't die, don't die, don't die. Come on, come on, come on. You can take it. You can take it. Oh, Aaron, you champ. Aaron, you champ. Espeon. We'll stay in. Espeon's his last one. Aaron, you champ. Hold on. Signal beam. Oh, yeah, it's fine. Crunch. Don't get me low enough. Oh. Aaron piece of crap <laughs> don't have anything good against it dumb quit getting crits sheesh cheater but cheater butt Aaron's gone too because of stupid crit. Okay, I'm gonna bring Bertha back. That was my special defense drop, so I don't think I want to stay in. That's way too much. I, do I predict here? He's not. Didn't have any more healing items. I don't think. I think I just stall out. Special defense is 118. You're 144. I'm like, you're gonna be weak to a second, but there's a full restore. Flames are gonna burn. Come on, come on, come on. I'm in a bad spot. I'm in a real bad spot. I think I live a psychic. I have to live a psychic. I do. Okay, we just stall. That's, that's the plan. Okay, we can just finish it off here. Cool. Stalls the game, my friends. Mm. Okay. Okay. So. <laughs> it's two members of the team down. It's a 4v6 right now. Bertha lost a life. 
Cynthia lost a life, Bertha lost a life, Aaron lost a life. Honestly, I don't know who, who what life. I'm gonna pull up the life counters right now. That's what I'm worried about. So pulling up the life counters to see what's left. since my final of last episode. So Cynthia takes, so um, Garchomp is gone, Drapion is gone, I have two lives on Gallade and Hippowdon, and a life on Magmortar and, um, and Polion. So, um, I gotta sack something that's Lucian or Hippowdon. What does he leave with? What does she leave with, though? I thought she doesn't leave with her guard chomp, probably. Does she? No. I think she leaves with her spirit. If I remember correctly, she leaves with her spirit team. What do I have that's going to be good against the spirit team? Crunch? Crunch? I can't return. I can't set up return. I can't. I, Lucian is useless in that respect. So Lucian is gonna be useless against the um, spirit team. We know this. But how is? I think it pout on my lead. I think it pout on my lead. I think it pout on my lead. I'm pretty sure spirit team will be gone. I need to take the black glass and all. Because, honestly, what is... I don't think she has anything that's going to be good against... Like, Ground's going to be good against it. So giving the black glasses here to Bertha is going to be really great. I need to keep Gum around to take out the Garchomp. And also going to be... I think she has a Milotic, so it's going to be good for that, too. Flint actually might be good for Milotic, too. But I'm pretty sure she's a Grass-type, like, um, maybe like a Roserade or something. And then I'm pretty sure she's a Lucario too, that Lucian also could take out, but again, we're pushing it here. So let's just go in. Let's just get in this battle. We can take her. I think we can take her. You gotta remember we have sand up now in the entire time. This is the moment here. This is the moment. Have you been keeping well? Thank you for Mount Cornet and after this and for the distortion world. I'm truly grateful. Together you and your Pokemon overcame the challenges you faced, however difficult. It means you've triumphed over any personal weaknesses too, but the power you've learned. You can feel it emanating from you. That's enough talk, let's see why you're here. As the Pokemon League champion, I accept your challenge. Oh god, six and four, I don't like the odds. Alright, oh, Spirit Team was the lead. So we're gonna chip it. Um, I probably should have used items here. That's a defense drop. Dark Pulse does a good chunk. How much was that roll? Let's check. I want to check the roll. That's about high. That's accurate roll. So that's a 90. Max roll is probably about 105. Okay, so that's a low roll. So we're, we're fine. We can hit another crunch off. It lives on one. We can live. Come on, come on. We got this. That's gotta be enough. Okay, spear team down. Big problem out of the way. Big problem out of the way. My Lodic. I need to keep. How is. Alright, I'm. Doing a showdown calculation. Showdown calculation. Uh, I don't want to play showdown. I want showdown. So maybe do a calc here. Damage calc. I need a. 
What do I need? Mag mortar? Blank mag mortar sets. And I need a um my lock sets. That was the speed. we we should outspeed, depending on level. Um don't, I'm gonna I'm assuming it's close what was her spirit team? 58, so most of her team is probably 58, so give the my law like 58. I'm doing the calcs right now, so that puts it at 116. About we are at 54, and we're at about 111. So with the speed investment, with the speed investment I have in my mag mortar, 116 is plenty of speed. But as a mag mortar holding a magnet. 192 special attack. Does it do enough? Now let's check it. So 54, 58, I got the stats right. Um, let's, see, let's give it 100. Let's give it 200. 198 to 15. 20. It's maxed out to 52. 190. Um, modest nature. Good or not enough. Uh, let's do 230, 10, 200, 199, 190, 200, 175, 296. What's my what's my actual speed? It's 192. So I need about one. Let's try 150. See what it gets. That's still too high. 145, 140, 130. 139. 139 gives me enough. And my Lodic, with no investment, if I have, if I am a modest nature, with 139 special attack investment, and I have Thunderbolt. How much is that doing? Thunderbolt does 40... There's about 40... Um, I'm holding a magnet. There's about 50%. So we have a shot to two shot it. Or does it have? S we have a chance to two shot it, but it's is it gonna be? What does it got? S it's probably got surf because I don't think skull was existed until generation five. So what does surf do? Surf is doing almost 100 percent. It's gonna come down to a roll. Honestly, I could come in thunderbolt, switch into Empoleon. Switch into Empoleon and heal up. I'm gonna try that. Oh, Flint strats right now. Alright, let's go, Flint. Please don't kill, please don't kill, please don't kill, please don't kill, please don't kill. Don't get a crit. Don't be invested specially. Just T Bolt. Give me a para, please. Para. Should do about 50. 42 to 50. Okay, got a max roll. Surf, don't kill. We should live. We don't. It's invested. It's an invested frickin' Milotic. Okay, I think Lucian comes in. Lucian comes in and sets up, I think. I hope. Oh, I need to set up Swords Dance. We okay. I'm at plus two. Let's Drain Punch. Okay, we're fine. Toga kiss. Not what I want to see. Gum. He's not going to be able to do much. She's not going to be able to do much to him. Hopefully. I want to heal Bertha up. Or a sphere. Okay. Let's not check accuracy. I don't fight this. Need you to miss. Shockwave. Just healing, so. Do I let Napoleon go down? Because I need Lucy and healed up. I'm gonna switch to Bertha.
Steel. Water pills. Great. Switch back to gum. Got air slash. Gum still has a life though. Got air slash. I don't have speed. I can't. There's no way I have speed. Gotta take the risk though. Come on, come on, come on, come on. Hold on, hold on. Okay, he's saving grace there. Oh! Okay, Sam takes it out. Okay, okay. I stay in. I'm gonna use a max revive on gum. Because gum has one life left. <laughs> Extra sensory. Alright, Lucian's got pretty good special defense, so let's see if I can have the potion up here. Oh my gosh, energy ball does a lot. It does enough. With, with hail damage, it does enough. So I gotta heal. Is there any way out of speed? Okay, I gotta I gotta do counts again. Blade. Give me a blank set. Give me a Rosa raid. No offensive. No. Give, give me a blank Rosa raid set. But we know they're invested somehow. Energy ball. Guaranteed two. Um, what, what was it? Yeah, the psychic move. What are you looking at? 219 speed. Uh, higher speed than us. 58. We're at 54. Level wise. 108. It's about 127 speed. How many running speed tier wise? Not great. 113. It's 127. We don't have speed. There's no way we have speed. There's no way. None. I'm gonna stall. So don't have speed. Lucian gone. I'm so screwed. Okay, I need to use my last. I have one life on both of these two mods. I need them both fully. Gum, you can live one. Gum doesn't have speed either. I'm not taking damage. Gotta be running out of moves. Don't heal. I think I take it. Full restore. Good shit. Good. 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 Good choice. Come on, freeze. Give me freeze hacks. One more. Oh, oh, extra sensory. Ran out of it. Okay, you die to. Um, I'm out of potions. Fully restores HP. Yeah, I'm just using my my max potion. Take an extra sensory, so I have pretty good health. Okay, Garchomp.
Gotcha. What else does she have? Spirit so we took on the Spirit Tomb, Milotic, Roserade, Togekiss. She has a Garchomp and a Lucario left. I, I pulled it up. Um, so I, I think I stay in. I have to see if I can. I got an Ice Beam and hope I can live. Live an Earthquake. Come on, go. Okay, I can't live an Earthquake, so I'm screwed. Super screwed. No defense drop. Garch up avoid stuff and I need dragon which thank you. Okay. Max Max Elixir, does that heal? Fully restores the PP of all moves, yes. I need all my moves back. Okay, so I just gotta get Dragon Rush to miss. Stall games are real, my friends. <laughs> That's why you come stalked, <laughs> boys. That's why you come stalked. You can live... You can live two Earthquakes, but does it go for... Dragon Rush. We can live two dra We can live two of anything. Especially when it's a mineral like that. Alright, let's crunch. Hope we get it. Come on, live. Live on 21. No defense drop. So we gotta turn every other turn. I don't wanna risk it. We need minerals. Cause that 21 is not looking very favorable for me. That was a high roll. That was another high roll. Come on, I need low rolls. Because honestly, you get two high rolls in a row, I'm screwed. That was a crit. Okay, I can live anything here. Oh. Defense drop. Citrus berry. Not what I want. I need a defense drop. <laughs> Bad. Come on, use flamethrower again. That was not flamethrower. Flamethrower again. As long as I'm in 100, I'm I'm KO'd. The thing is, I can stall out your moves. Crunch. Giga Impact! No! to the champion of the elite floor. Just to lose. Well guys, Nuzlocke is over. The game is over. We have been defeated and it's all thanks. I call it though. It's all because we lost Cynthia. I needed Cynthia. That's big on my loss here. I had an extra life on a couple things. If I kept Cynthia around, I kinda I did un I wasn't leveled up enough. Because you have to come at like level 60 for Cynthia. But I think at a higher level easily can go through and destroy Cynthia. But um I got level 55 but I assume that was enough. Because I don't want to over level. So you can't yell at me for not over leveling but you can yell at me for under leveling. But uh the team Final team needed Cynthia for the Garchomp, so Garchomp versus Garchomp is the play all the way. Close. Aaron didn't do too much, but still put in a good bit of work on Lucian, so that was nice. Um, Gum really put in some good work this this playthrough. Kind of glad I picked it as my starter Pokemon. Glad you guys suggested it. 
for the starter Pokemon. Um, I really didn't care which one we got, um, but if we did have uh, choosing Torterra gave us three ground types and choosing um, um, Infernape would give us two fire types and two fighting types. So uh, Gum probably was the best bet for a starter Pokemon in this league. Um, Steel typing really killed it though. That's the whole. That's why it died. Steel typing. Flint, what a great mon, uh, really cool, really glad to use, uh, Magmortar for once. And, and, this one. and Lucy and I just didn't get the setup. The setup, we ran through most of the team. Bertha just put in some work for hip out on so. Oh, that's the end of the series, guys. Oh, we did our best. What can I say? We did our best. We used... We had like what 60 hyper potions going to this. We had no hyper potions. We had 130 some full restore down to 99 now. We tried. We really tried. It came down to a big impact that I was not expecting for some reason. Should always heal. I could have stalled out the guard chomp. I probably should have just done that. But we make our mistakes and we learn from those. But that is the end of this series, guys. I hope you guys did enjoy an almost hour-long special when we fought the Elite Four and Champion. Sadly, we did lose to Cynthia at the end, and I can't give you a happy send-off in this series because I don't have any more lives left. <laughs> I would greatly go back and try the Elite Four again if I had Gum and Bertha on one or, one or two lives left and just train them up, give them a little bit different moves to take on things and go from there, but... Quite a matchup, quite a game. What can I say? I had a lot of fun with this playthrough. I hope you guys did enjoy it too. And if you did, as always, leave a like. Show your respects for the team in the comment section below. Let me know if you are doing. You yourself are trying out one of these elite locks for yourself. Rules are always in the description. But I'll go over them one last time for you. Each Pokemon gets four lives. One for each of the elite four members. You take their best Pokemon, their strongest Pokemon, the highest level, and use it. However, I did not do that exactly with this team. I would have a Rhyperior as well, as a, instead of the Impaldon, which would have been fun to do, but I know Bertha. For me, it's just weird if I didn't have Hippowdon. So, I used Hippowdon. So, you want to try this with Rhyperior, be my guest, go right ahead. And then you obviously get to choose your starter Pokemon. I let you guys decide that, and you guys chose Piplup. Um, probably what I would have chosen anyway. But it was a fun, fun series. Real great. And I, I, I gave my best in the end. I tried to stall out, and I just couldn't do it. Uh, messed up with the... I didn't expect Giga Impact, and I should have. That was a big misplay on my part. So, um, what can you say? It was a great series. I had a lot of fun. Thank you guys very much for watching. Hope you guys do try out Elite Lock for yourself. As I said, description has all of the instructions on how to do an Elite Lock. It's so basically a Nuzlocke yourself. Um, it really helps in if you trade in the game, like in the Pokemon for the games, like from a different state file. Like you can IV and EV breed them as you want, or you just do something random. I used a Pokemon Pokegen and randomly generated the ball that they were in. Na the nature they had, I kept the same um, ability as the actual Pokemon in the game because I did find that out with the Glade. But uh, let me know if you, what you guys want to do. Um, if you guys want to, if you guys doing it one yourself, I would love to see that. But uh, let me know. Shoot me a link on Twitter at chaosman 6 Follow me on there because you want to keep up with the date, everything going on with the channel and my own life but that is where we close the chapter we close the playthrough we shut down this game once and for all pokemon platinum elite lock quite a series i had a lot of fun thank you guys very much for watching you guys are the best as always but until next time i am chaos may 006 signing off